what? I just took a fucking motorcycle all the way from PV to Bucerias, where I used to live here when I was 21 years old for a few months. But let me tell you, that did not feel safe. Not one fucking bit. <laughs> I'm gonna try to find a ride home if I can. But yeah, this is the uh, entryway into Bucerias. And guess why we came here? I forgot to tell you. We are going to a kite surfing competition. And apparently we are getting VIP passes, which, you know, is necessary because I'm a celebrity of Puerto Vallarta for fuck's sakes. Just joking. I think, are we leaving? Yeah. <laughs> I gotta go, bye. Someone's gotta do it, right? Someone's gotta do it, babe. <laughs> Don't tell my mom. <laughs> One of his main mirrors is broken. Look. How fucking sick can you get, dudes? So I lived here back in, um, what the hell was it? 90. In Bucerias, it was a dirt road, dusty, dusty, boring as fuck Mexican village. Very, very quiet, very quiet. Stray dogs, they sent her with a gazebo and nothing. We were bored out of our freaking minds. So we went into uh, Puerto Vallarta all the time to get tanked and whatnot. <laughs> but now Bucerias is a massive development and uh, it's got a different vibe, but we're gonna have fun anyway. Oh, <laughs> my God. We're dead! I have put a light, protection of light around. that I'm here. I'm here with my friend that loves going to giant fucking concerts and this is just right up his alley. Yay, spending the day with four billion other fucking people. Anyway, gotta get tanked now. The guy, the guy who gave me this is the owner of the, of the tent, of the, how do you call it? Oh yeah, cool. Quiet event on the beach. 
denial about reality. But yeah, it's it's pretty exciting. It's quite beautiful. There's dudes competing out there right now. And I don't know what else to say because I know nothing about this fucking sport. there's other people here. <laughs> Look how many fucking people are here. Like a quadrillion. Why? Why? I'm more like the person behind me with that blue umbrella. Like, so lamente. <laughs>
So anyway, that's the news. Um, I gotta go. I'm extremely busy not doing anything. <laughs> okay, bye. I just went freaking swimming. And the water is like soup. It's like, I don't know, if you like soup, let's just say it's like brothy. <laughs> it's warm. And it's going to get way worse, but right now it's quite beautiful. But apparently they're giving out the wards for the kite surfing. So we're heading over there right now as the sun is about to set to check the shit out. No. Ah, yes. 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 You've been hosting this event for 13 years. Hey, no. She's already doing it. <laughs> She's already doing it. <laughs> it's your turn, I'm doing it. Happening? What's happening, I'm man? Yours. Are well, you a pro kite surfer or what? Well, I'm one of the oldest in the fleet. I do now a strapless. Okay. I'm not pro, but I, I get the kite for free. People give it to me. I mean, they're very, very generous to me because I have some level in the sport, so people like to push me. Hey. You know, so I'm super happy with that sponsoring sponsorship once in a while. Yeah, Where are you from originally? I'm Mexican, definitely. Mexico from, City, from Guadalajara Puebla City. Yeah. <laughs> we missed it. 